Oh, good day. I'm Trevor. See you found my fishing spot. Wasn't that much of a secret after all. Oh, good day, guys. Welcome to another episode of Fishing with Trev. I'm Trevor. River Street Boat Ramp, Pioneer River, high tide. So 5.4 metre high tide today, one metre low tide, so there's going to be a lot of water going out. As you can see, it looks like I might get rained on above my house. Blue sky. Weird. Hey, let's get this sucker out there, see what we can get today, eh? Hey guys, it's a windy day today. We've got 35 to 40 kilometer hour winds out at the mouth, so I thought I'd come back to the uh, old wreck that was here. I got some really nice herring at the boat ramp. Some of it's too big. Hey, but we'll see how we go, eh? As I said, guys, got some good herring at the boat ramp. A few of them are a bit big. We'll see how they go though. A couple of nice sized ones there. Not too close to the wreck though, because I did lose a heap of sinkers and hooks last time I was here. That's about close enough. See how that goes. And I seem to be on. Ooh, better set that one up. Hope he don't go over the rock wall. I lost a couple towards that rock wall there. That's about 20 metres that way. Oh, queen fish. Wonderful. We like the queen fish. Awesome. Good to see the queen fish are coming back in. We have had rain for about three or four months and all the fresh water, all the fish disappeared for a while. They're coming back and in the boat with him. Been here probably five minutes, just setting up my second rod. There we go guys, first of the day. Oh, stop it. Hey, spikes. One nice little queen fish. He's legal. Yeah, he's running 550, 540. Hey, let him go. And off he goes. Oh, and I seem to be on again. It's been about five minutes. <laughs> I'm having fun here when it's windy as hell out the front you always find a spot to oh. oh he's tangled up in that line by the look of it under or over he's over uh, whoa where you going Come on up, you come. A GT by the look of it. Love me GTs. They're an awesome bloody fight. And they're not bad eating either. A lot of people won't eat them. Fresh, filleted. Salt and pepper, but heaps of butter to cook them with. 
Same with queen fish. When you're cooking fish, you don't want to be chucking too much on it. You want to preserve the flavour of the fish. Thinks he's a grunner. One hook out. One beautiful looking giant trevally. He's running. Ah, let's see, four, 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 four fifty. Hey, we'll let him go. Awesome. And off he goes. Seem to be on again. Something's been eating the eyes and the head. Missing the hook, the so I chucked in half a dead herring on this one and held onto it. Something went at it. What have we got this time? Oh, brim. Nice brim by the look of that. Very nice brim by the way you're going for it. Oh, and one yellow fin brim. Oh, he's a horse, this one. And one hook out. Oh, having trouble with that hooker, too. You one yellow fin brim, he's a beautiful bloody brim. Oh, stop, stop, stop. He's running 30 35 centimeters. That's a beautiful bloody brim. That'd be a good table fish. They're a very slow grower, though, even though there's a heap of them here. And off he goes. And I seem to be on the other rod. This one got snagged. I ended up putting a hook back on it. Took me a while. Kept on getting busy with the other rod. And what have we got on here? Put a bit of herring on it. And a and another yellow fin brim. Not as big. Mm. Oh, stop that. And he's running. Yeah, he's legal. He's running about 25 and a half. Awesome. Nice little fish. Off he goes. And that's how we should get him. Beautiful. I was just getting some bait. This one's gone off. Oh, what have we got on Bit of herring on it. So there was only a few large ones left, but I found there's some herring under me at the moment. It's a nice size one, so I might put them in. Oh, look at this, another beautiful yellow fin brim. Oh, look at that. That is one nice looking fish. Another chunky one. And he's running. Oh, stop it. He's running about 32. Yeah, 32. Oh, wait there. Yeah, 32 centimeters. Beautiful bloody brim. Nice table size. Off you go. On this 
nine. See if I can get him out of the snag. Yep, I think I have. Feels like There's a lot of snags hanging off that yacht, but it's worth it for the fun. I wouldn't have been able to go fishing today because it's too bloody windy elsewhere. Oh. Cod. Another species, that's the fourth one for the day. Fourth species. Come here, Codly. One gold spot rock cod or gold spot estuary cod, depending on who you're talking to. Beautiful little fish, way undersized. Let him go, he's a fat little bugger. Off he goes. Again. Oh. What have we got? I'd say another brim. By the feel of it. No, cod. Is it? One cod. On a live herring that I pulled out of the water before. And he's still got the herring in there. And one small cod, I'll let him keep his herring. Off he goes. Awesome. this one what we're using is my six foot ugly stick I'm using the shorter stronger one so I can pull them away from the boat easier 15 pound line 20 pound fluorocarbon leader it's fluorocarbon all the way through it's a size three wide gap hook which I always use they're very gentle on the fish they just catch them around the lips normally so a corner of the mouth. <sighs> Normally run a running sinker jig on it. <sighs> what have we got? GT by the look of it. Oh yes. A hey, nice looking GT to finish the day off. Nearly time to go home, so... Oh, beautiful looking GT. Look at the size of that bloody thing. For the river, that is a good fish. And one hook. One hook out. That is one nice size giant trevally. What's he running at? 460, 450, 450 long. Hey, that's a nice one. We'll let him go. And off he goes. Bloody awesome. Hey guys, that time of the day again, time to rock and roll out of here. I've had a bloody fun session. I, uh, I've caught some a couple of nice GTs, I caught me Queenie. Really nice brim, 35 centimetre. You can't sneeze at that. Hey, I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have, and I'll see you next week. Yous have a good one, eh? If you like what you see, please subscribe, click the bell for notifications and share if you like. You have a good day.